Hello everyone, welcome and welcome back to another reading another video. In today's reading, we're gonna do one. It's been a while, I know, for Hero Tiffin love interest currently. So this is gonna be rather exciting. So all of you guys are doing amazing and remarkable as you are, as always. So let's just go ahead into the reading then. We're gonna starting off with the energy. So let's see, please for tell us Hero's energy, love and romance as for right now. Please two cards, we have the six of cups. Very nice, very, very nice. I think there is just a lot of affection and compassion around him. It's just like he felt good about things, you know, energetically he feels safe, he felt comfortable. And also we have the star, Oh, that's really nice. We're not only specifically talking about romance though, I know that probably like, you know, the reason why you click is just like late to see if he's dating anyone. But we're gonna get to that by the end of the day. But we have the Knight of Cups in here. So I think she's, uh, I'm sorry, his, I'm sorry. Um, I think he's very amazing, you know, doing the things. It's just like everything is in his, in his favor lately. Everything is going well and very interesting, I would like to say in here. Something um, unique about to happen or um, already played out happening as far right now. So we have the Six of Cups. It said children or childhood, revisiting old dreams or plans, embracing your inner child, the return of people or, rom or romances from your past, romanticizing how things used to be. We have the star, have faith that future is bright, dreams come true, positive changes that bring an end to challenging times the light in the end of the tunnel so mm, the, this energy is kind of like giving me you know when you lack of motivations when you suddenly just you know got nowhere to go and just have no idea about the things that are about to happen but suddenly it clicked into your mind that things are really used to be good you know things are pretty went well for you in the past and you kind of like recall those energy you know recalls those memory in your head kind of like daydreaming a bit you know and and taking you back far far into beautiful memories that you have especially regarding love and romance and try to pump up you know kind of like giving him himself a motivation into what about to come in this life so it's very unique like i said kind of like channeling the past energy into future into you know building your future it's like revisiting the past for the sake of building the future so yeah i think he's he's not having that much of a deal you know happening in his life right now so that's why he's kind of like feeling you're so empty i don't know any zodiac signs but i think it's scorpio isn't it right that's why we have the two cups energy in here and we have the page of cups too after this so i think yeah he's a scorpio so scorpio hold back a lot you know hold back a lot and they you know tend to keep that to themselves suffers and suffers in silence they don't like they're not the biggest fan of, of like bragging about sadness or happiness right they're the one that kind of like always mysterious in their thoughts we don't know what they're thinking we don't know what they're planning we don't know what happened in their life so basically that's the scorpio but i think it's just you know kind of like i don't know what i'm gonna do right now it's just like i have no idea you know like i don't really like you know intended one to dating anyone at the same time i don't want to connect with anyone but i really want to do you know like i re i need to so there is just lack of motivation and he's just crawling back into the past you know crawling back and thinking like wow things are used to be good and remembering himself like what is the purpose of everything like why i want to be loved and i why i want to love a people you know i want to love a person in particular so you know again revisiting old memories and the star kind of like speaks a lot this is the aquarius card so i think things are been weird at least you know at least weird in here lately in his life it's just like you know just have absolutely no idea so you know it's just like um, an event or a moment happened in your life and you're just like what's even the point of this happening it's just like you know it doesn't affect me in some way i don't get affected and it doesn't really give the benefit at all it, it neither it's you know giving you a conflict or a challenge of some sort so it's just like what's the point of things even happen so you know like questioning like the methods of life at the very first place so that's what happening in his energy right now very, pretty confusing but i think it's you know doing a pretty good job you know a solid job to hold on into this feeling this is kind of like a really strange feeling if you imagine yourself you know caught up in those energy so let's see we're gonna pull three cards about the surroundings let's see please spirits what happened around him as for right now around hero love and romance we have the three of coins yeah very very nice solar, solar plexus chakra let's see two more we have the ace of wands pretty nice that's what I'm, I'm feeling like a lot of like a thunder you know like inside my chest i feel like there's just a lot of happening um yeah he, he he might be you know lack of motivation at time but i think things are going 
like there's a lot of things going on in here and this is also the lower chakra bottom deck we have the six of wands okay ace of wands kind of like screaming at me right now so i think his you know the surrounding is kind of like desperate encouraging him to open up a new chapter in his life kind of like maybe <clears throat> sorry about that you know trying something new perhaps travel some somewhere you know since maybe he loved exploring and he's pretty much a man of culture so he loves you know seeing new things in here and it's pretty you know close with summer too so i think he's planning up um, a lot of trips that maybe when he's scrolling instagram or, or google it's just like you know this advertisement about travel is always everywhere it's kind of like a sign for him so yeah pretty much that the surroundings you know that happen and also maybe have uh, you know yeah happened to his family friends relatives kind of like wanted to go you know and, and travel somewhere so he's kind of like i cannot stand you know stay still here alone like i want to go somewhere too so like i said you know the surroundings the people around us shaped us in so many different ways and it affected it affects us in some way so i think this is the fact for him kind of like you know people want to go like i have to go too it's just like encouraging him to do that and we have the three of coins so i do see maybe a lot of wrapping up movies in here you know finishing up i'm hearing just you know closing you know kind of like closing the chapter in here finishing something up like i said um so pretty much his as far as i know socialize a lot with the people that is really Related to his job and career and work he's you know pretty focused about that and we have the strength card also in here which is number eight kind of like representing the karmic in here so i think he's kind of like trapped in kind of a deja vu moment right now it's just like i've been here before kind of like you know i've been here before like why you know it happened to me again so i think the answer of that is because he doesn't really got a closure for the thing that happened before so it could be with families you know it could be with friends it could be with people around here it could be with girlfriend ex-girlfriend he doesn't really have a closure and he intended to do that you know to get a closure around this time so yeah it, it can be as simple as maybe you know um, um finishing the book that you read you know as simple as that because like i said i do have a really big feeling um he's like a man of culture you know and wanted to know a lot of things pretty much and naturally curious you know that's in his nature in his habit so you know pretty much when we're talking about love and romance it's a really broad subject you know subject to talk to in his favor in here so yeah six of one is about victory so i think there's just a lot of happiness you know around him there's just a lot of gratitude he's just feeling so amazing so good even though things not all you know sparkle and perfect i mean no one is and nothing is perfect and all sparkles but he found you know the perfect moment he found the things that he can be grateful about and taking the positive into thoughts in here into his benefit which is really really you know a noble thing to do you know very full of dignity all right we're gonna moving on into what happened in his current love life as for right now so let's see okay please spirits for cards what's going on in hero tiffin's love and romantic life as for currently please for cards we have justice very nice very very nice so it's kind of like you know what comes around get, you know goes around in my head immediately we have the eight of pentacles yep romance and love life please burn we have the page of swords in here let's see one more we have the wheel of fortune all right very interesting but i'm like we have the four swords yeah so i think he's just found himself like lack you know again lack of motivation he doesn't really like again you know but i'm like he's four of swords so he do doesn't really like up to a lot of things as well right now but at the same time a lot of things happen in his life so you know kind of like a, <laughs> a zombies you know without a direction it's just like i got a lot of things to take care of but at the same time i really needed a break you know i really needed time to like take care of myself and just you know like a, a lot long long break you know to recharge my energy so i think it's pretty busy i know we're not pulling the cards for the past but i i recall a lot of past energy in here you know i think he's been so busy you know he's just been so busy and pretty much a lack of sleep you know lack of, of motivations as well so we have justice eight of pentacles page of swords and wheel of fortune wheel of fortune kind of like you know very vibrant in here very vivid so wheel of fortune is kind of like turning back the table so you know kind of like okay that's how it you know things got to be played out so um 
you know there is a phrase in my head i think this is from a song or from camila cabello um it said like isn't it something that i get more when i give you nothing isn't it magic when i stop looking for it happens so basically um when he's trying you know really motivated and really up for something nothing really happened in his life he's just like what you know like it's not even happening but when his lack of motivation is needed sleep and needed you know pretty much a long break things a lot a lot of things happen so maybe that's a very you know in a very first like why he's asking like what's even the point of it is like why it happened in my life so there's a lot of complaints you know in my head right now immediately um yeah so we're starting off with the justice in, justice in here so yeah the phrase what comes around goes around definitely played out in my head so probably he receives you know a lot of um you know feedback you know a lot of love from the, pa- the fans in here he's just you know doing pretty good job you know pretty balanced at times and after this we have the eight of pentacles so yeah he's trying to work things out you know with some people in his life it could be with a current girlfriend if he, if he has one of course um you know with you know best friend i think because of the busy schedule that happened in his life he's just you know lost time you know and and never really got around to update you know much people in his life but at the same time you know when you want you know things to be just okay you need at least to make sure that you know everything is okay you know towards that person and confirm that and clarify that so i think he's trying to reach out as much people as he can at this point it's just like you know telling people like i'm good you know i'm sorry for not having you know been you know up update you a lot lately because i've been you know there's just so much that i'm up to right now and after that also we have the page of swords so i'm really convinced that he's pretty much maybe as far right now looking forward for traveling or at least his head is in there you know he's just looking forward for you know this escape of moment you know so summer the state of mind so that's uh that's pretty vibrant a split in the deck in here we have temperance yeah and he's pretty lit up about that pretty lit up um to be frankly honest looking at this card i don't think like he's really dating anyone you know yes maybe he have his eyes on someone but he's not like really dating anyone i don't really feel that you know not at all not really feel that um yeah should we continue spirits no pulling one more card okay we're gonna pull one more then okay we have the nine of cups yeah okay that's maybe the source why he's uh, super happy i think maybe because of the list you know um yeah his list is pretty much checked and a lot of things you know he's just finishing up early you know from his schedule from his um, wishes and manifestations so he's just pretty satisfied with the things that happened how things played out and i think it's connected with his love and you know and financial life and and job because it's pretty much you know very in mind not really you know really in touch with your heart i mean count how much um, cups card we have you know only the six of cards which energetically not the things that he you know that not the action oriented one and the nine of cups that's the only thing we don't have any cups so far so that's how he's you know pretty much in his mind not really in touch with feelings and not really get you know the emotions kind of like overwhelm him in some way he's not he's not giving the access to that as far right now so all right we're gonna continue into the love interest so love we're gonna find out is there any love interest in his life right now so keep in mind the love interest doesn't always mean dating right it could be just you know teamwork collaboration family distant relatives so let's see if the spirit is he have any like is there any love interest in here let's see his life as for right now we have the higher event okay i mean he's keeping his options open though you know he's keeping his options open i think that's the perfect way of of saying it we have the five of pentacles but he yeah no you know he doesn't he, he he's not like really landed just yet you know so is there any love interest i think the in plain english no there is no love interest because love interest means like you know it, in, in in two ways right you know he's interested with someone and someone is interested in him so maybe just a lot of him maybe try to you know get to know him but he's not really interested in that so i would like to say no and also bottom deck we have the eight of swords because why because he he knew that there are a lot of things that he needs to deal with in his own right now you know he just needs space for that and you know pretty much doing his own thing you know pretty much you know self-love getting to know himself i mean he's pretty pretty young right talking about age in here but maturity is maybe above that but since you know this schedule is pretty much pretty much messing up you know his <laughs> you know schedule for love life he's not really looking as well as he's keeping his you know his options open but he's you know no one's really interested just yet you know no one's really interesting just yet yeah 
so that's it all right we're gonna pull the next please for it is he dating anyone so far from that i think the answer will be no let's see two cards yep no nope, not at all it might be he's just recently separating from someone not in the terms of dating though in here we cannot really speculate into that let's see one more we have the queen of pentacles yeah yeah pretty much super guarded and super grounded no he's not dating anyone right now bottom deck we have the two of pentacles but i think he have the you know it's just like someone that he liked that he interested in not available right now so that's the feeling that i get so we have the seven of swords and the imagery in here kind of like a third party situation so you know i think there is also the reason like behind like why he's not dating anyone because probably the one that he's interested in is not really you know available in terms of status or maybe you know not available in schedule so it's just like yeah you know not a perfect time for dating and he's pretty stoic about that you know pretty accepting he's just like yeah 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 you know i'm not really like that obsessed you know with you know like how, how my love would turn out i think yeah he's pretty simple man you know if i think about that right now if you think about you know these actions this reaction that you have um that she, that he had in general he's pretty much simple you know if things up to me you know th there is you know things that that is up and you know i will pursue that if, if things are delayed i will appreciate that you know if if there is someone interested in me let's see about that if i said no that will be no way you know so pretty much you know straight into the point you know um, an easy person to work with you know imagine having this person in your group assignment you know that will be just that will be bomb okay all right we're gonna Last but not least, we're gonna pull off his energy, his element in here. So let's see the last card of uh, the universe. Please put two cards from the universe to ending up this reading. We have beloved in here. I don't think that's uh, the case. So I will um, shuffle again. Yeah, this one. Please put We have expansion um, in here. Spread your wings and soar. Share your message and shine your light. Share the world what you are made. Show the world. I'm sorry. I'm not wearing glasses in here. Um, show the world what you're made of. Really, really nice. Let's see one more. Leah, yeah, you know just handling things on his own in here we have also leadership nice step into your leadership role um share your message inspire and empower others yeah pretty much he will be busy i think all year long let me know if you want like second of 2022 you know for you know his um reading let me know if you'd like that but i would like we have a freedom really nice live wild and free choose your freedom claim your independence yeah he's not looking forward or of dating anyone in here like for sure you know if you see like all about this is action oriented and it's always up and up and up right not you know going down he's just expanding you know being a leader and you know pretty much living by the mode of freedom in here you want to be free and he conquered the world like you know he wanted to conquer the world by the end of 2022 so yeah um that's got a bit for the reading you guys if you'd like to book a reading link in the description right away you can see that you can click that and also you can approach me in gmail uh, oceantero93 at gmail.com and as well as um uh, from um instagram <laughs> oceantero93 so you can check that out and thank you so much for being here don't forget to like comment subscribe and you guys i appreciate you guys i appreciate you guys pretty much all the time and always sending love and energetic heart uh, energetic hugs towards you and thank you so much again and i will see you in the next one um don't forget to rest okay everyone because i felt like some of energy it might be my own but you know if we if you felt uh, tired or something um take a rest okay take a break all right uh bye for now god bless you